In this video, let us see how to do reduction using Calibre Exact GUI. During the post layout simulations, the designers simulate the circuits with the parasitics. Since lat circuit designs can stain the performance and capacity limits of the simulators, reduction of this netlist size is important. Let us see how to reduce the netlist size using Calibre Exact GUI. We have the design open in Cadence Virtuoso and as we run Exact by clicking on Calibre and run Exact, in the Calibre Exact GUI, I have rules, input, outputs, I chose Exact mode and extraction type as RCC and Calibre view as the netlist format. In options, I chose Specs Reduce and Log since the layout path is a GDS2 format and click No. We are running here without reduction. The exact run is now complete. We can check the netlist size using the command window. Let us now run exact with reduction. In options, I'll go to PEX Reduce Analog and check yes. PEX Reduce Tizer Reduction. The reason I was choosing Tizer Reduction is because Tizer is the most accurate and recommended reduction technique. It is also a frequency based technique with the default frequency being 1 e to the 13. Depending upon the designer's requirement, they can choose required frequency. In my case, I choose 5 e to the 9 hertz. Calibre Exact also has different reduction techniques for coupled capacitors. I check on absolute threshold and ratio percent. According to my circuitry, I choose 3 femtofarads as the absolute threshold and 3% as the ratio percent. It's up to the designers to choose the required one. I choose the two values because the combination of two will reduce the errors introduced into the simulator because of reduction. Now we run exact. Once the exact run is complete, we can check the netlist size using the command window. Here we can see the netlist size with reduction is almost 70% less than that of without reduction. Therefore, reduction of this netlist size improves the simulation performance by making it faster with accepted level of accuracy. I hope you found the video useful. Thank you so much for watching.